So me and Daryl are making Thanksgiving dinner together today. So I'm breaking up this onion. I'm trying to make it a little bit smaller so I can stuff it inside the chicken. I'm gonna season it with salt and pepper so that we get a little bit of flavor inside the chicken. Even though it's gonna provide flavor itself, we'll just try something and hope it enhances the flavor a little bit more. And we definitely seasoned the heck out of that chicken. Yeah, we did. So. Now let Daryl season it. Might not have been the best idea. <laughs> Look at all that seasoning. Yeah. It looks like it's already cooked, Daryl. That's how brown it looks. So we got the garlic in there. So let me put some. I feel like that's a lot of onions. Salt. Yeah, but it might be too much onion. It, onion is not really a strong flavor. Yeah, it is. Not when you cook it inside and you're not eating it. I hope. All right, so. Now Daryl's gonna be disgusting and stuff it in this nasty little chicken. I'm not one for. Chicken stuffing? I'm not one for touching raw meat, to be completely honest. Yeah, Spread out the garlic That's a little. Remember, we're just trying things here. We've made chicken before, but only with like a recipe out of the Women's Health magazine. So this is kind of new. Yeah, we don't have any lemons, so we couldn't do that today. Yeah. So this is new. Put a little bit of butter in there. That's what I saw in a magazine. That's what I was thinking too. Some butter. Let us know what you guys seasoned your turkey or chicken or whatever you ate with. I think next year I want to have ham, or maybe for Easter we'll have ham. I don't really like ham, but. Huh? I think we got enough in there. So, yeah. Just put it around. Yeah. It'll probably burn though. That's okay. Maybe it'll melt some juices around it. I'm gonna put butter on it. I was gonna figure just put, like stick a butter on top of it. A whole stick of butter. Just let it melt on down I'm there. just gonna stick butter in here. Stick butter in there and there. We're just using the stick of butter for the turkey so you can touch it. And then in here and in there. This is what I saw online. I don't know how well this is actually it's gonna like, go. It's like deodorant for the chicken. Yes. Put it under arms. Chicken has stinky pits. And stinky kneecaps. Stinky thighs. Stinky chicken. Ever late. No pens. Where's your bow? Where's my bow? Now that's gonna wait for the oven to preheat and we're gonna start making the potato. Everly's got her bow in, Clover's got hers in too, but she's a sleeper now. So, just looks like that, it's so cute. Thank you so much, Stacy. Do you wanna tell her how much you love them in their hands? I love them, Stacy, thank you. Everly, <laughs> baby, that'll hold her. So we're cooking the potatoes. I'll show you. We only had like three <clears throat> small potatoes, but once you fluff them up and you add the stuff, I'm gonna add sour cream and butter because um, I saw that recipe on a couple of places. Um, I know you can add milk and butter, but I'm gonna try the sour cream. And then we have the chicken in the oven, and oh, it smells so good. And um. The stuffing, corn, and rolls obviously will cook later. And then the apple pie will actually cook while we're eating dinner because it takes 40 to, 45 to 55 minutes to cook, but it just looks like this. So I wish I could have made a homemade apple pie, but we just didn't have the money to buy everything next year. Or for Christmas, maybe I'll make a homemade apple pie. I don't know. A Latisse one. Mm -hmm. So. I think me and Daryl are gonna watch a movie. <sighs> I'm tired. I don't know why I'm. I'm not really tired, like tired, like sleepy tired, but like my body is tired. Last night was a rough night. It was a long night. Daryl let me sleep today until like 10 in the morning. Daryl. Daryl. Huh? You let me sleep until 10 in the morning. Yep. 
I didn't want to sleep till 10 in the morning, but I'm happy I did because I feel really well rested and I caught up on some sleep. He always lets me sleep in when he's home. Are you Dustin? Sweep it up. Oh, she took your card. On the floor. You gonna sweep it up? Stupid bag on the floor. I'm so mad at him. I took forever to collect these blocks yesterday and he let me throw them on the floor. Okay, so the mashed potatoes are almost done. We got butter, no. sour cream, milk, no. and salt and pepper. No. I didn't put the salt and pepper or the sour cream in yet. Yeah, the sour cream's going in now. We need a little bit more. No. And just mix it up. No. Everybody's chilling out with us too. Then I did decide on red skin mashed potatoes, so they're a skin, but that's purposeful. Yeah. These are like, I don't know if you guys did Applebee's, but that's a thing. I'm gonna pass it for you. We use salt and pepper on everything. And the chicken we just checked, uncovered. It's doing good. Yep. Right here. Mm -hmm. Keep vlogging. I'm going to have you taste that. Cheers. Want me to start and finish it? And that way you can film me tasting it? I'm just putting on what it means. Nice butter. I thought there was skip the wrapper. Okay. Okay. You wipe your hands off. I'm fine. It smells very delicious. Don't start too rough, honey. You want to keep them fluffy. Daryl thinks everything needs more salt. Salt brings up the flavor. Okay, I said don't stir it too, too much. It'll be fine. It loses fluff. Perfect. You want to tell them what it tastes like? It tastes like mashed potatoes. Special mashed potatoes in there. Right, you want to lick that off and then have, let, have, let Ev try some. Ebbs awake still. And then just put the lid on. No, don't put the dirty fork that you licked back in. Ew. Put the lid on, nasty. So, now we're just waiting for once the chicken gets down to like 20 minutes, I'll make the stuffing in the corn and then the rolls also, and everything will be ready to go for us to eat. And hopefully, Clover will be up. Can you put the sour cream up? Um, so right now we're watching Hancock and I'm about to wash the stuff that I'm going to need um, to cook because Daryl made pancakes this morning. So we will show you everything when it's done. Ooh, that's the one. So the chicken we believe is done. It's nice and crispy on top and you get a lot of butter around it and juices. You can hear the crisp. You can hear the crisp in the skin. And it's probably very moist. I'll slap you. I think it's done. The little bunny. Mm -hmm. Okay. Should I cut the top and see? Hmm? Should I cut this part? It's up to you. I think it said on the thing when the juices run clear and the juices are clear. So. Okay. So now we're going to move this over to the pie plate because it's the only place we have for it. And I'm going to do the chicken, the corn, and the rolls really quick. And then it'll be time to eat. Yep. This is our Thanksgiving. There's our chicken, nice and cooked. And we got our rolls and our mashed potatoes and our corn and our stuffing. And the pie is in the oven. And the pie is in the oven. Looking all delicious. Clover is here. I released her own fit because she's ready to eat. She's like, give me food. Give me. Okay. She's done. She's done. Clover is still waking up. So she's got this like tired look on her face. 
Everly just likes being near Clover and watching her. They're they're silly. You ready to eat Clover? It's Thanksgiving. Yeah. yeah, she shook her head. As usual. It'll be fun next year to see if she says no to everything. <laughs> you just chilling back out there, Everly? Do, 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 do. We hope you guys are all having a great Thanksgiving. Yep, we hope you're all having a good Thanksgiving. These two are going to have some yummy, yummy food. This is Daryl's plate. I ended up making him gravy because he wanted some gravy. So, just rolls, chicken, yep. stuffing, corn, gravy, mashed potatoes. Mmm. Mashed potatoes with the gravy is good. The chicken is very good. Yes. And the girls are destroying their food. It seemed like maybe holding my phone was helping because she was like had something to hold on to. Everly just took her first like real two steps. So we're gonna see if she'll do it again for you guys. It was amazing. We both thought she was gonna fall. Hold it. Yeah, put her face in me, because remember I said come here up and she started walking. Clover, come on, you're gonna keep pushing. Be careful, baby. Come here, Ev. Come here, go see Mama. Mama hold you up. I can't do this to her if I'm holding the camera. But I can't. Come here. Face her to you and see if she'll come to you. Stand up, baby. Put your feet down. Put your foot down. Balance. Come to that. Go see daddy. Go see daddy. Go see daddy. Come here, Come here Everly. Clover. <laughs> so Clover's just wearing her little sweater dress with tool on the bottom. Um, she got that from my friend when she gave us the hand-me-downs that was in it. And she keeps pulling the dress down. It fits her. She just likes to do that. And then she's wearing some heart, some pink tights with hearts on them. And she's got her turkey bow. Clover, let me see your hair. So pretty. I really was wearing her cute dress that you guys saw, but she got it dirty. So now she's pretty much naked. <laughs> Medea is back with her own brand of Christmas cereal. I'm so mad we weren't Medea filming Christmas when she walked. I know. We're too excited. But it was exciting that Daryl was here for her first steps. What did it feel like seeing your baby take her first steps? Exciting. Because I thought she was going to just all of a sudden, next thing you know, just woo -woo 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 all over the place. That's the start of it, though. Clover took her first steps one day, and then the next day she took, like, probably, like, 40 steps. Like, not in a row, but she yeah. just kept getting up and walking. And then a couple days later, before I knew it, she was everywhere. She was falling all the friggin' time. That's the, that's the most hilarious thing in the world, is watching them fumble around. <laughs> Clover! Clover probably doesn't remember not being able to watch. Shake your booty! Shake it. Uh, look at Clover get that! Shake your booty! Shake your booty! Yeah! <laughs> Shake your booty! Tell her shake her booty. Shake your booty, Clover. Shake your booty. Shake your booty. Shake your booty. It's funny that she knows what shake. Oh, careful! You're a weirdo. I saw what she just did. What? Maybe that's why she can't balance her diapers full. Did you see what she did? What? She was on her knees and then she just flipped her legs up and it went straight backwards. Clover, shake your booty. Shake that booty. Put your arms up. Arms up. Arms up. Now spin. Arms up. Arms up. I'm like echoing. Clover, arms you up. hear it? Arms up. Clover. Clover. Arms up. Spin. Spin. She wants to dance with you. She only likes the songs. Shake your booty, Ev. Clap, Everly. Clap, Ev. <laughs> She's trying to walk like that. Oh, man. I'm so excited.
Look at her. She's all disappointed. Like, wait, it's over now? Yay! Look at her. She's trying. She's thinking about grabbing Clover's hand, I think. Stand up, Ev. Okay, Daryl, so what are you thankful for this Thanksgiving? I'm thankful for having all my babies here and being home for Thanksgiving for once. Mm, Everly is a cutie pie. Everly, what are you, oh, Everly, what are you thankful for? Uh-huh. Food. What, what else? What are you thankful for, Clover? Mm. Mm. Nothing. Clover, what are you thankful for? Mm. Nothing. That bottle, apparently. <laughs> Did you like the food, Clover? Mm. Do you like me? Mm. Do you, are you nice? <laughs> Clover, are you nice? <laughs> Clover. Look, she won't answer that one. Are you nice? She won't answer. Because she don't want to say no. <laughs> Everly. <laughs> Clover, are you nice? Are you nice? Clover. Are you bad, Clover? Are you bad? <laughs> Wait, I'm still telling us what you think. Dada. Dada? What about Mama? Okay. <laughs> Just a grin on her face. So I am thankful for Daryl being here and both of my girls being happy and healthy. And just, we had a really successful Thanksgiving. None of the food was bad, everything was delicious. And like nothing got burnt, nothing turned out bad. And I'm just really, really- Chicken happy. was the bomb, yo. <laughs> Chicken was the bomb. I'm just really happy that we had a successful Thanksgiving and that Daryl gets to be here with his family, relaxing and enjoying what Thanksgiving is all about, which is being thankful for everybody and delicious food. Mm-hmm. Anything else you're thankful for? No, I'm all good right now. What? My girls? We're thankful for you guys. Oh. <laughs> Nikki's like trying to hint here and I'm like not catching on. We're anything. thankful for all of you and we appreciate your continued support and love. And we love all of you and we're genuinely wishing you a very happy Thanksgiving and happy holidays this year. Yep, and stay safe. Don't drink and drive. On Thanksgiving? People Do people drink, drink on Thanksgiving? Drink I guess there's football games. They like spike eggnog and stuff. <laughs> so, yeah, we're really thankful for you guys and we love you. Alright, bye bye. <laughs> it's pretty. More. Give her some on her cheek. Put some on her cheeks. Put some on her cheeks. Oh, you done? Put some makeup on her cheeks. <laughs> new clothes every single day while Pretty. Other one. Put it on her other cheek. Tell she knows what cheeks are. I didn't know she knew what she said. Hmm? I told her to put some makeup on Ev's cheeks and she immediately put it on her cheeks.